So, right. interesting. Thank Very you so much for the story. Time now is 6.16. Check out this gorgeous view of the sunrise over Metro Detroit. Just lovely here looking at Lake St. Clair and the Detroit River. A chilly start, though. Another cold one. Uh, yeah, uh, smoldering sky. I wish we could get some warmth associated with that as well. Yeah. We're looking at uh, another cold start. Yeah, cold start. Some spots in the 40s, even the 30s. Ooh, Ann Arbor's been bouncing back. Yeah, right in now. August. Ann, Ann Arbor's been bouncing <laughs> back and forth. Uh, before we get to those temps, let's talk about the smoke that's taking place from that mulch fire. And it's a big one and it's producing a big plume of smoke that extends not only for the west side of Detroit through downtown towards the east side, but you'll see this is spilling over downwind, crossing over the river into southwestern Ontario, and it pushes as far south as Leamington reaching down towards Lake Erie. And the reason why is because this has been burning since last night, yesterday evening at around 630 roughly. Uh, and we're looking at the air quality concerns there about a moderate and I'm thinking it could actually get upgraded, localized perhaps, where it could be unhealthy for uh, sensitive groups, the elderly, young children. So of course you're going to smell that if you're anywhere near the vicinity of that fire. The other story, the temperatures, five to 15 degrees cooler this morning than where we were just yesterday morning and it was below average yesterday. So there's the 39 degree temperature I was referring to in Ann Arbor. We're at 53 in Pontiac, holding on to 52 at the airport and you're in the mid to low 40s just south of the city in Adrian as well as Monroe. This is where we're headed though. We should be able to bounce back well into to the 70s for today. More sunshine, fewer clouds, lighter winds will help us to warm up. And then the local lows as the skies clear up, the winds remain light. We're expecting this air mass to go to work once again, taking us right back to the 40s, mid to low 40s in some spots. Chelsea at 45, Brighton 47. A little bit warmer, closer to the water on the east side, but Dexter's at 43 for tomorrow morning and a little bit better once again in Lexington, but still cool. The cool weather will be gone by this weekend, taking us into next week as a pattern reversal sets up shop. You'll see that depicted in the seven day forecast mid to upper 70s into Thursday. And how about the 80s pushing the 90s by next?